During a visit to Thailand uh, with young Kyron Wilson, where he competed in the Six Red Championship, which incidentally he went on to win, we were very fortunate to be guests of a local club called the High End Snooker Club. Lovely little place. Karen and I had a little bit of practice and then I followed it with a little bit of fun. And Karen asked me to demonstrate a, a trick shot which he seems to believe I'm particularly good at. That shot went on YouTube and some of the channel's subscribers got wind of it and they've written in asking me to repeat the shot on the channel. Well, I'm quite prepared to have a go at that, but I want to demonstrate the fact that there is a purpose behind it. Now, I like to keep this game as simple as I possibly can. And if you've got a fixed point at the front, your bridge hand, a fixed point at the back, your body, and you bring the hand forward to play the shot, you've got half a chance of delivering that cue in a straight line. But the couple of points I want to really reiterate is the fact that these fixed points are only fixed points if you don't move them. And if you move them even minutely, over a distance particularly, you're going to miss. So try to keep them as still as you possibly can. The other factor is the grip. It's no good just grabbing hold of the cue anywhere and anyhow and just hitting the body and thinking that's good enough. It doesn't work like that at all. And I would urge you to have a, have a look at my videos on the grip. Now, I'm not suggesting that all good players grip the cue like I do. Of course I don't. That would be silly and stupid. But what I do know is that the front of the hand gives you a good chance of controlling the grip. It also helps you to unfurl these fingers, yeah? And if you're unfurling those fingers, it just helps you to try and keep the cue parallel with the bed of the table, as much near as possible. So if I can demonstrate the shot, I've got a fixed point at the front, fixed point at the back, and from there, once I've aimed, I can look away, move the cue, put it back on the fixed point, put it back on the fixed point and play the shot. Now it's very difficult to do that while I'm talking, so while I'm demonstrating this shot, if you don't mind, I'll just have a go at it and keep quiet. So here we go. Now, I'm not going to kid you into thinking that I can get that shot successfully every time. I can't. I'm not that good. What I can do is tell you that I can get a fair percentage. But again, I'll come back to those points. Fixed point, fixed point, get the grip working correctly, away you go. Give it lots and lots of thought, lots and lots of practice. And good luck with that practice. Mm -hmm.